You want the truth. You can't handle the truth. Build it and they will come. This is a New Jack City, homie. Turn up your sound component wherever you are right now. We check out the volume and be able to tell what you have for lunch. The next hour is going to change everything you think you know about building your business, starting your business, and raising the money for your business. Show me the money! Hello, everyone, and welcome to the Reg A Money Show. This is Ron Kostow here in studios in Las Vegas. We've got Miguel Dotris. Miguel, how's it going today? It's going great, Ron. It's great to be here in the Reg A Money Studios with you again, as always, uh, putting together another show as we uh, see that things in the Reg A atmosphere or, or sphere, as they say, have been heating up. And, uh, you know, Ron, we yeah. – go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. I was going to say, interesting ch- choice of words because it's about 114 degrees here in Las Vegas. So, yes, everything is heating up. <laughs> everything is heating up, my friend. Yeah. Listen, let me tell you something else. You know how we here on the Reggae Money Show, we'd like to bring our listeners with, with the most relevant and timely information. You know, when, when, when Myoma was going public and was being listed on the New York Stock Exchange, who's the show – out of all the shows on the entire uh, uh, Stitcher and Spreaker and, and iPod, who, who, had, who had one of the key elements of that thing going public? Yeah, Reggae Money Show, right? Reggae <laughs> Money Show. So as part of that yeah. commitment to our listeners and to everybody who listens out there uh, on Spreaker and Stitcher and now on iTunes and, and soon a Google Play, okay, Google Play is the new one that we're, we're going to want to get listed on, so, so, so listen to this. So as we diagnosed for all our listeners out there that transaction of how Myomo was able to uh, be listed on the uh, New York Stock Exchange, Ron and I uh, took that whole thing apart, and we have for you guys next week, we have interviews uh, for the next couple of weeks, actually, right, Ron, if I'm not mistaken, we have the CEO yes. of Myomo joining us here on the Reggae Money Show to talk to us and to talk to you guys about his journey to uh, a public exchange. And then after, after that show, uh, that monster of a show, we have another monster of a show behind that because we have the CEO of TriPoint Equities, uh, also known as Bank, who did all yes. the back-end uh, uh, execution of the securities and what they call the book runner for the deal, is also going to be joining us on the show here on Reggae Money Show. Can you believe that, Ron? Yeah, I mean, if you really want to know everything about reggae, uh, you don't need to go anyplace else but the Reggae Money Show. I mean, you know, I'm, I'm really, I am so psyched about the quality of the guests that we're getting on this show, all the, the, the people asking the questions, and, and uh, yeah, this is a great topic. The whole SEC thing is very, is very interesting because, like we said many, many times, uh, Regulation A-plus offerings are real stock offerings. They're, they're the real deal. It's not like, you know, you'd get a T-shirt or whatever, a trinket for contributing to a crowdfunding campaign. This is real, this is real stuff. And we've got to bring yeah. these guys on, Miguel, uh, to clarify the whole process and to you know, uh, make it useful for the, for the, for the listeners. No, absolutely. And, when, and by the time that we get done with our analysis and, and our, our uh, taking a part of this thing and putting it back together again, what we want you guys to understand is that Ron and I are putting these things together so you would have an insider's look of what is going on inside of the reggae market you're going to have an inside look on how these guys are taking these companies from you know basically a startup and and taking them all the way to an exchange now my is a very different animal in itself and we're going to wait to that show to kind of get you know into it but what we wanted to talk to you today about and what we're going to when we come back from our break here on the reggae money show from the reggae money studios uh what we're going to be talking to you guys today is about you know, one of the major components to the reggae uh, offerings, and that's working with the Securities and Exchange Commission, the big SEC. And I'm not talking about football. I'm talking about the uh, commission, <laughs> all right? And, and what I'd like to do, Ron, if it's okay with you, I'd like to take a little break 
uh, for our listeners. We, we, we can come back in a few minutes. Uh, you know, we can pay some of the bills that we need to pay. And then what we can do is we can come back because I want you guys to understand the next two weeks you're going to be getting information about exactly how Myoma went public, you know, the steps that they took. Now, you've got to understand that that was an $8 million raise, okay? That was a, an established company. Uh, that was doing robotics, a very, very unique situation. Now, if you guys were listening a week ago when Darren joined us, and Darren is the CEO of Crowdfund X, right, and he's the guy who put the entire social media marketing and the whole marketing with all his artificial intelligence and all that stuff that he had going on, right? So what we're going to try to show you today is, you know, there is a, a, a government entity that you guys are going to have to figure out and maneuver through to be able to bring your offering to light. So what we want to do today is we want to cover a couple of those points, some of the important points that Ron and I have, have come up with, which we've put us some, some analysis together for you guys, so that way you guys have a good understanding, and then we're, we're, going, to go, we're going to go up against it. And, and then, Ron, I thought that you know, today would be a great day to tell everybody, you know, you know uh, the Reggae Money Show has been on the move. Uh, as you guys yeah. know, we, we started on Speaker and we started on uh, on Stitcher, and then we moved to iPod, uh, iTunes, and then pretty soon we're going to be moving on to uh, uh, Google Play. But Ron and I have been talking about you know doing a nice format change to our show because normally, guys, as you know, if you've been listening to us over the last you know, a few months, you realize that, you know, we come on and we, we do a lot of analysis about, you know, uh, what, what aspect of the offering you're going to be working on that week. And then we'll bring in an industry professional or an industry insider to kind of give us that prospectus. So that way you can get a, you can get the prospectus from a, a professional that is inside of this. And so what we're thinking about doing, and, and, you know, we're more than welcome to, to call us or to reach out to us and run, you know, what's the website that people, if they have questions or they want to get more information, where do they go to, to bring us their feedback, Ron? Yeah, they go to regamoney.com, R-E-G-A money.com. Or they could also go to ipotogo.com. It's ipotogo.com. And once you get to either one of those sites, especially on the Reggae Money site, uh, there's a link for the Money Show, and you could uh, ask us a question. You could request to be a guest. All that information is right there, reggaemoney.com. Right. So, right. so, we, so we, yeah, so, so, so just go, going right along with that, if you guys think it's a good idea, what, we, what Ron and I are proposing is this. We're going to have you know, usually our opening segment where we kind of tell you, what, you know, what's what and what's going on and, you know, what direction we're going on. Then we're going to bring our industry professional and then what, 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 and, you know, we'll do the fluid disclosure with them and ask them some personal questions so that way you guys get to know them a little bit. And then what, what Ron and I were thinking about is we're going to bring up like an up-and-comer, you know, like a, you know, a contender, you know, some guy, some guy who's, you know, either testing the waters or, you know, kind of just filed their reggae, but a guy, you know, or a company or a girl that, that's kind of like, you know, going into this thing so we can kind of get that newbie prospectus, you know, and, uh, and, and get that point of view also. So, you know, I hope you guys stick around after the break. You know, you've been listening to the Reggae Money Show with me, Miguel Dotrez, and Ron Costa. And, uh, you know, we're going to cut for a little break right now. When we come back, we're going to talk to you about the importance of and the role of the Securities and Exchange Commission. So stay tuned. Sounds, sounds good, Miguel. We'll be right back. Thanks. <laughs> 